so hey guys welcome back once again and in today's video i'm just gonna talk about one of the interesting extension that you can go and install let me tell you guys now you can easily correct your deform hand and you not need to get an extra step like third party application in order to go and correct your hands so i'm talking about depth library guys and you can definitely see over here this library it has so many depth hands going on over here and yes you can easily install this library as well so it's just a similar to like open post editor and yeah definitely it's pretty handy now you can go and correct your deformed hand as well let me tell you guys now how to install this first of all just go on to extension menu first of all search it on the available menu if it's available then click install over here because when i installed this extension it was not available on this menu so i just use this url so if you don't find on available section then you can then you can paste on this url i will link it in the description paste on this url and just click on to install mine's already installed install as you can see it's already installed after you click on to install just apply and restart ui it will automatically install this library so simple and yet so powerful library that you can go and correct your deformed hand as well because there are total of 31 hand postures going on you can definitely see there are two pages right now so first of all you can see there is a resolution option over here you can go and change your resolution based on your image the next thing is add what it will do it will add any of the posture that you have selected just like this we will select this and just click on to add it will add it over here so that's how you add the posture select any of this and just click add so it will keep on adding so now let's reset this and the next thing is very important and that's add background image so if you want to correct deformed hand of any of the image just click on to this just like if i want to correct this hand so just add it and the next thing you need to do is just add any of the hand posture just like we will go with this and we will add it so it will add it over here and then you can scale it down or whatever you want to do scale it with this option and rotate it with this option okay so that's how you do it and just place it exactly where the hand is just like this let's place it over here adjust it perfectly on the hand and that's how you do it you can add any of the hand postures the next thing that you need to do is that if you want to send it to text to image right now there are only two options save as png and send to control net if you click on send to control net it will send on to text to image you can definitely see it will send on to text to image and yeah it will load it over here on control and if you want to use it on image to image section just like this so what you need to do is that you first of all need to save it as a png just like this i have already saved one like this hand and this hand we will save another one as well let's just click on to this so that's how it is very handy to go and correct your deformed hands over here so now let's check how it works first of all we will check on text to image i will show you this was the prompt that i was using to generate this image and this seed as well i will just add my prompt over here negative prompt and the next thing the seed the seed is very important so just paste the exact seed of your image and let me tell you how to work just click on to enable and just select any of the preprocessor or model that you want to work with the next and the very important thing is guidance start because guidance start is important in order to go and correct your deformed hands or deformed parts of your body so for me 0.05 was working great for me yesterday so i will go with this value and let's see what result do we get so guys as you can see that is the result that i got definitely amazing and yes the hand is changed as well if i show you the original image this was the original image that i generated look at this hand and look at this hand and yes there are a lot of changes going on over here but the seed was the same as similar to this image so that's what i got with text to image let me show you i was working on text to image and now we will check on to image to image section as well so let's go with image to image section here as well similar prompt just like this we will add the original image over here enable the control net model if you have low vram then enable this as well select the preprocessor and model and the next thing is your guidance start so i will go on to like 0.05 here as well and that's it so this is the hand that we are using first of all so now let's generate and let's see what result do we get with like image to image section as well so guys on image to image section that is the result that i got pretty amazing if i compare it to like text to image see this was the image with like text to image and this is the result with image to image section so that's why i will always recommend you to go with image to image section than to like text to image if you want to correct the hands because i always find result on image to image section pretty accurate and pretty close to original image as you can see still it's a deformed hand and now what we will do we will try to mess around with guidance start as well let's go with 0.1 this time we will also go with different model as well let's try different model 0.1 guidance 
Boolean strength and depth model so let's see what result do we get so guys as you can see that is the result that i got and yes i can definitely say that depth is not working so what we will do is that we will just go on to canny model only let's check on to canny model at this time and guidance start 0.1 so let's check one more time and let's see what result do we get so now guys as you can see definitely a perfect hand going on over here and yes it has improved a lot so definitely canny is working for me and you can go and experiment with different model as well but guidance start is very important for me 0.5 to 1 to 1.5 works great but above than that it will also start deforming so this is also very important guidance start as well so that's the thing that i wanted to talk about and yes definitely you can go and generate as many hand as you want so we will just check on to this hand as well so this time we will go with different hand and yes let's see what result do we get this time as well canny preprocessor canny model and guidance start 0.1 and now let's see what result do we get with this hand as well so guys as you can see that is the result that i got with different hand as well pretty amazing pretty simple and pretty easy easy to use so guys that's how you can go and use this depth library and yes it's very easy to use as well depth library you can definitely get so many hand postures over here isn't it easy to go and correct your deformed hand so that's why i found it very interesting and yeah you can go and install it it is very easy so that's it for today guys i hope so guys you understand it and yeah that's it for today i will be back with more and more videos tomorrow till then have a good day bye guys love you all guys bye guys